Y'all get ready. Yes, you get oh, ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl, Tisa. I wanted to come out here and do an update on the whole Tristan Thompson situation. This entire situation is a hot damn mess, honey, but I'm here for it, bitch, okay? So what's going down is this. So basically, as I reported the other day, Tristan Thompson um, was basically caught cheating on Chloe. The video leaked back in October, and TMZ was sitting on this for some strange reason, only to leak it the other day. But now that's not the craziest thing, okay? So after that story went viral, the very next day, Chloe went into labor at 4 o'clock in the morning. She gave birth to their baby girl um, in Cleveland. Cleveland, and they were saying that Tristan Thompson was there, the mother, all of her sisters were there as well. They've also been noting that Chloe has forgiven Tristan, that she's been knowing for months about the cheating. And like I stated in the video, that I would not be surprised if this was going to be aired on Keeping Up With The Kardashians, if they were gonna make this an entire storyline. Now my tea sippers have hit me up on social media letting me know that I was right in my assessment. It's now being confirmed that cameras were rolling during this whole cheating scandal, during all of this drama, during all of this viral mess. So again, I would not be surprised if Kris Jenner's behind all of this. Was the cheating real? You're damn right it was real, okay? Tristan third tried Mr. Thompson is a straight up man whore, okay? So yes, it was real, but the point is they filmed everything, they leaked this story, and they were there to make sure to capture everything on film, the social media reactions, Chloe's reactions, you know what I'm saying? They're saying that Chloe has known about this for months and that she's forgiven him, hence why he was there. But in other news, you know what I'm saying, with all this foolishness, it's definitely ruined his reputation. While in New York the other day, they were getting ready to play the Knicks, the people in the stadium started started booing Tristan Thompson. People have been going in on him all over social media. The paparazzi caught him coming out the hospital the other day. You know, so this is definitely taking a toll on his image, you know what I mean? But again, it's his fault. He's the one who was out there cheating and doing all the foolishness. But it's crazy that every time a guy gets with the Kardashian, they always manage to have the cameras there to capture everything and then make money off of the controversy. So I'm not surprised at all, but Kylie Jenner was took to social media to basically tell Chloe Congratulations. So this is what Kylie posted onto social media. Go ahead and check this out. All right, so you guys just saw what Kylie had to say. So Khadijah Hack, who was Chloe's best friend, took to social media, and this is what she had to say about Tristan Thompson. So Khadijah says the best thing a father can do for his children is to love their mother. And then she quoted John Wooden. And then she wrote Forever Khadijah. So that's what she wrote to be in solidarity with her best friend. But I find that really funny because Khadijah, you were the same one who when Chloe was dating French Montana after she took French Montana from Trina, you were fucking his best friend Chink's drugs, okay? And when Chink's got killed, people thought that you were his girl only to find out that he had a wife and a baby on the way with another chick. Hi, B. I just told her I, was, I understand that she's sad and it hurts. It's hurtful and sad. It's sometimes you cry. But you have to like, keep going. Yeah. And I think he would want that too. So where was all this compassion for Chink Drugs' his kids and his wife when you were out there being the side chick and fucking a dude who you knew was married and had other side chicks? So miss me with the holy than thou speeches, Khadijah. You, Chloe, Tristan, 
All you guys are birds of the same feather, so that's why all y'all flock together. Like I said in my initial video, I don't feel bad for any of these people because what you put out there is exactly what comes back to you, okay? So this entire situation is a hot damn mess, but I am glad that Chloe gave birth to her daughter. From all reports, the baby is healthy and doing fine, so congratulations to Chloe. But under this particular circumstance, it's definitely a messy situation. But in true Kardashian fashion, they're gonna make sure to milk every last bit of this controversy and make sure to get that damn bag, okay? So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation concerning Chloe having her baby, Tristan Thompson getting booed, Kylie Jenner shouting out her sister, and Khadijah Hack trying to have her best friends back, even though, you know what I'm saying, she was also fucking a married man. You know what I mean? I just found that whole situation comical. And then last but not least, are you guys surprised in the least that all of this will be played out on the ease, keeping up with the Kardashians? And do you feel like that's why this was leaked out on purpose being that TMZ has had the footage since October they're just now leaking this out is because they wanted to build this storyline up so let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces Hey you guys, it's your girl T. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share my videos. You can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise. Also, don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.